What's good, guys and gals? Andrew himself here. Bring you yet again. You know what the game is. So, holy. Okay. You good? Are you gonna work well for me this session? Probably not. Alright. <laughs> so, when we left off, uh, I said I was doing uh, Agricraft slash. Uh, Pam's Harvest Craft. Uh, so I got a few thing, a few pens built. Eh, I was got a little T-Rex hat. Nice. So I got a few things built. I didn't do too much work, but I got a few pens uh, for some animals. So not overly, not overly much. Uh, it took a bit uh, leading these guys. But that's because <clears throat> some of these pens um, were actually um, plot land like that. So I had to take all of that, put some in a storage house, and lead these guys and the sheep and the cows all here. Because these guys are pretty easy. They just spawned like right outside the wall. So just grab some seeds and grab some seeds with my pickaxe, <clears throat> dug a hole through the wall, and it was pretty easy. Pretty done. Pretty what easily done. There you go. So, um, a lot of my tools and weapons broke, and I forget where I placed my inventory. So we're gonna make a few things from scratch. That's okay. So, um, oh yeah, and on my adventure in finding animals, <laughs> ran into these guys, the Crimson Cult. Actually, I never wore cult boots, boots. Okay, so that's pretty much the same thing. Alright, let's see how this works. Boop, boop, boop. What's up? Right. Not bad. Not bad at all. Too bad that pants and helmet are like nearly broken, but not bad. But I'll just use this stuff. Why? Because it's cooler. Yeah. So, uh, moving on. Oh yeah, we have a saddle, and we'll need these because because I ran a creosote to make more crates. So I had to build this puppy to make creosote oil. Because with the creosote, uh, you get to make treated wood, and that treated wood becomes crates, which is all the stuff I used to uh, pack my skeevies and move on to the house on the cliff that you saw in my previous videos. Like this right here. That's probably where all my inventory is. Let's check. Yep. Well, that's where, yeah, that's where most of it is. All right. Okay. Cool. So that's where that went. All right. Boop and boop. So we'll just put all this stuff in here for now. All right. So moving along. It's nighttime. Hmm. Uh, let's make some shears real quick. Real quick. Okay. And I also built a trap. Oh, well, not just a trap. More like a punishment. Well, that's where all my crates went. It's been a while since I plugged away at this friggin' thing. Oh, hello. I see ya. Hey, man. No, 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 no. Don't you do it. Don't you friggin' pop. I was gonna say, if you lag and you explode, I swear to God, dude. All right. Uh, what else? Oh yes, right over here. Oop. Hey man, what up? Oh, wait. There's an Enderman. 
This is a prisoner. Yep. He's our prisoner. As well as bait. Okay, over there, spider. Yeah. Okay, you're a witch. Okay. You see me. Let's uh let's just go over here. Oh, you fell in the trap. Still hit me with stuff. And then you go. Alright. I hear ya. Where you at? Yeah, right there. It's like having nine dollars. It's like having nineteen dollars in your game account. Oh, you hit him. Okay. Well. They found a way around it. Apparently, that guy that guy owed them a dollar. <laughs> well, that sucks. But, no oh well. The fragger was overly expensive anyway. 21 gems and like 10 seeds for something common. Screw that. Screw him. Uh, there we go. Alright. So we're going to have an orange bed. Beautiful. Or not. That's okay. So, let's place it All right. Let's open this up after a nice night's sleep. What we get? Under pearls and lots of gold coins. Nice. There is a villager in here who takes gold coins as currency. I don't know if his stuff is rare or not, but leather pants, nice. All right, uh, let's put these in there as well. Uh, we still yeah, let's have some decorations. Why not? Open. Thank you. So let's put. Yeah, right there. So this is our no. This is our little barn type thing. So this is where <coughs> all the uh, livestock food is gonna go: seeds, wheat, and carrots. That's all. This is all where this stuff is gonna go. And the rest, well, I haven't really decided yet because we're still in the process of growing everything. So, speaking of growing, let's get busy on that. Uh, we got some coffee and tea grown here. So, because some people just can't seem to start the day without it. I myself am a coffee drinker, so I know what that's like. So we got some coffee seeds growing here and tea seeds growing here. The rest, <laughs> I don't really know yet. So let's, uh, let's, let's pick some seeds. And in here, nope. All right, but uh, I have a few gardens in here, and we'll and we'll uh, drop those in a bit. Oh, here we go. All right, there. Alright, 
So there's that row. Alright. Uh, let's see. So we'll plant that there, that there, and so on. There we go. I probably have a few of those crops inside the uh, inside the greenhouses, but that's okay. Some uh, some food recipes will cost quite a number of them, so so maybe two or three won't be all that terrible. All right. So let's do up the rest of them. We're just gonna go for one crop each because. <clears throat> Because uh, right clicking on them um, sometimes gives you seeds and you can get some unidentified seeds and they'll sometimes have stats to them. And if you want to get really complex you can actually have a pair of clippers and you can make, <coughs> you can clip samples of those crops and you can possibly um, combine the two. So, in case you haven't noticed, I have a few poppies in here because November is also Veterans Veterans Month. So I planted a few poppies in the spirit of spirit of Remembrance Day slash Veterans Day. So there you go. A little reminder of of how we're all here. There you go. And here. Kiwi, cranberry. Yeah, might as well just plant them over here. Might as well. Because this this one is looking a little bare. What's this? Cranberry. Why are you not planting? Do you not require sticks? Apparently not. Alright. Oops. Okay, so the outside, the outside um, planting is all done. Well, not all done because there's still quite a bit of room there. So, but as we progress, it'll probably be full of stuff. All kind of full of all kinds of goodies. So, in the greenhouse, we have quite a bit of stuff. Um, oh yeah, I forgot my uh, my hemp seeds. I'll have to plant those after, because, but right now they're not important. All right, so we got some bell pepper, which apparently can be analyzed. Some melons, some cinder pearl, some blue orchid, which can be made into blue dye, which is nice. Rhubarb, rye, anyway, all the fun stuff. Uh, what else is here? Mustard, broccoli. Okay, so some of the crops I planted outside are in here, but that's okay. Like I said, you can have more than one crop, and he'll be fine. All right, there's nothing there, nothing there. What's that? Can't just fruit, nothing there, and nothing there. Oh, and there's more poppies in here. Nice. One, two, there's three crops of them. Okay. What else? Raspberry. All right. So it's a little, it's a little unorganized, but when you right-click, it all comes up. All right. So it's cactus seeds. Okay. So what do we have here? Okay. So we got our honey now. Honey, honey. All right. I don't know what those wax combs are for. Probably nothing. But we got that, and we got that. So now we can do this. Nope. We can do that. Get the honey out of there. And queen bee. Royal jelly. Place that there. Bee grub. And we get another one. Eventually, all queens are replaced. There you go. Get to work, honey. Eh. 
Anyway. So. Uh, what else? These are all unidentified, so we're going to play with the identifier. That's why I have the same same seeds here, but they're clearly um, at a different level. So we'll have to identify them and see the difference. So these are all the same level because they stack. This is not. So there's Orca. Okay. All right. So let's just do this. There's the seed identifiers over here. Water outer choke. I don't know how they're grown. I'll have to look that up because it's bugging me now. There's a few aquatic crops that I that I want to grow, but just simply don't. Oh well. All right. So let's go here. Let's do this. That's all being put in the journal. All right. Not bad. Okay. Very nice. That is a very nice seed. All right. So now that they're all done, well, that's. Cotton seeds. Okay. Alright, so that's all done. What else can we do here? Okay, let's. Okay. So, this is all Pam Service Craft. So these are all the seeds. Yada yada yada. So, we're gonna do. Let's see. What are we going to do? Persimmon. Oh, there's also uh, some trees outside that I planted. I've got some saplings. Uh, I'll have to move my witchery stuff up too. Oh, there's my watering can. I knew I had it here somewhere. Oh, this is the rest of my inventory. I don't know why it's all in here. Alright, so we'll need that. Alright, well, we'll clean that up later. Uh, right now, let's plant that there. Let's. Fix this because I accidentally stepped on it. There you go. All right, cool. So let's plant some of my heads, shall we? So more than likely, have be spot in here. So let's plant some of my heads. Where at? There we go. There we go. And there we go. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. All right. Some of the villagers in here. Um, take wheat as as a form of payment and they pay you emeralds in exchange for it and as you saw outside there's no shortage of it so it's pretty so emeralds come by pretty easy in this town it's pretty nice so with the uh, with the market in that one over there I'll be able to get pretty much every seed I like it's nice it's really nice uh, as far as Christmas I'm still pretty clueless on which one to make, so so I don't know which uh, which mod to do for Christmas. There's none of them, none of them that really strike me as a holiday. I mean, this one is, and the witchery one was, but as <laughs> but for the Christmas one, I'm pretty much stumped, folks. Let's see. There's got to be something, something. That's all witchery. This is Thawncraft. This is all tech. This is all decocraft. None of the menus come up for decocraft, so I'm assuming this is just for um, this is just for creative. And this is all for RF tools. Oh, there we go. It's presents. So I suppose I suppose we could just fly around a creative. And just place deco craft or something. I don't really know because so far this is all I've seen in terms of in terms of uh, Christmas holiday. So there's presents, candy canes, all of the fun stuff. So so far we have that, but I would make it all legitly. But for some reason deco craft doesn't have a crafting menu, and I don't understand why.
What else is there? Oh, this is all Pam's. This is all Pam's Harvest Cross. This is all the excellent food uh, we can make for in spirit of uh, Thanksgiving. This page. Yeah, so there's quite a few pages of food we can make. Um, I can strive to make most of it. So we're going to do some fishing as well. Because we can, because with Pam's Harvest Craft, we can uh, make some fish traps. We can collect some bait. And we can also uh, craft a fishing rod and do some fishing as well. But uh, fishing is, is kind of boring to watch, so I probably won't, won't include that footage, which I'm pretty sure you can thank me for. Because of being in the traps, all you need is uh, just some regular fish. Oh yeah, here we go. There's, there's a few things we can do. We can turn tests to presents, and we can and we can turn uh turn leaves into Christmas into Christmas decorations. It's not much, but it's something. So I guess we can just play around with the chisel tool. I guess. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do. Instead of a mod, I think I'll just I'll just play around a creative, and we can build I don't know Santa's workshop. I guess. Might as well. Or we can play legitly and just craft everything by hand. That way I should have some content to upload. Oh yeah, I made one of these, but for some reason it doesn't work in this game. I don't know why. There is... Oh yeah, there's a tab for it. Alright, well, let's just make this real quick. Actually, no. I won't make it right now. I'll probably make it off camera, but I'm not going to make it now. Oh, you're one of those, um blaze type things that are around. Yeah, I hear you. Go away. Alright, so let's pick some dragon fruit. Nom 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 nom. Come, gimme. Thought I planted something on there. Maybe not. Alright. Alright, so I'm gonna head on up to the to the house, and I'll bring some supplies down here. That way, it won't take as long to do anything because I'm pretty much running around like a headless chicken. Alright, now we're back. Yeah, I see he's coming behind me. Creeper. Alright. So, just finishing up. Dropping off the rest of our stuff. So, let's cook some. Temporary meals, shall we? Why? Because some of the meals require actually require some of these meats. Like raw beef, pork, chicken, all of them stuff. I do have some raw calamari here, so we can make some of that. And the trap bait. Well, that's why we we uh, planted some cotton, so we can have some string. I actually m might plant more cotton then, if that's the case. That way we can have a bunch of uh, bunch of seafood stuff. I don't know if many of you like seafood, but options there. So it's pretty much string and three fish. All right, are you cooking or? Oh, yeah. Okay, let's not cook the calamari just yet. I have a feeling you can use that. You can use the raw stuff for a meal. Oh, here we go. Let's make some cookware while we're waiting. Cutting board. So a piece of iron and a stick. I'm pretty sure we can handle that. Iron. I say with great confidence, and yet I don't see sticks. Did I put some in here? No, I did not. But, if you're not, pretty easy to obtain. You now, let's just take the border of this. This could take a while. On second thought, let's just take only the first three because we don't need that many there we go all right so now we're in business after frig knows how long all right so let's let's just do this okay so one stick and one piece of iron oh I didn't see that and there. Beautiful. Will this go on top of that? 
<laughs> yeah, it will. Okay, that's cool. I like that. All right. So we got a cutting board. What else can we make? A pot. All right. A pot it is, man. And we have and we have pot. Mm hmm. All right. So let's keep our our cookware in here. I think that's a good idea. Skid it. All right. So let's do it up, home skid it. There we go. So this will be our our pantry, pretty much. Saucepan. Okay. Saucepan. Oh, we got a saucepan. All right. Bakeware. Oh, fancy. We we'll need bricks. Oh. I bet I made all my bricks into blocks. Right, let's see if I can break them apart. I cannot. All right. Uh, I should have brought my clay down. If that's the case. All right, well, we'll make it later. Morton pedestal. Mort mortar and pedestal. Or mortar and pe I don't know how you pronounce that. All right. So we'll need some stone. Mm, fancy. Do we have stone? We did not. Of all things to bring down here, I did not bring stone. Where can I take stone from? Right here, I guess. Do I have a pickaxe? I do not. Alright. So I guess we'll just do that for next video then. Uh, what else? Mixing bowl. We can do that. That and a stick. Mixing bowl it is. Beautiful. Alright. Juicer. Fresh plate. Okay. So we'll not make a juicer just yet. So, out of all the pantries, we only we didn't do three of them. Not bad. Not bad at all. Fresh water. Oh. All right. Well, we might need these anyways, but I hope it doesn't take up the, the water bucket. Because before the update, it did. So you had to go through a buttload of friggin' iron. Oven. Will we need an oven? I don't need 60. Whatever. I used all my friggin' bars making that jail cell. But, that's okay. Furnace. <phone rings> Screw it. Let's just do it. Give me this. Might as well make a diamond one then. Might as well. I have the materials. There you go. Boop. Oh, buddy. Getting achievements. Alright. Um, there we go. And now for the oven, we have that. Okay. Took me a minute. There we go. Boop. Boop. Oops. And boop. There we go. I'm assuming this works the same way. So, there you go. Alright, and since you never put stuff on top of a stove, let's just do that. There you go. Alright. Cool. Alright, and we 
got some steak, we got some bricks. Nice, this place has turned out really homey now. Okie dokie. What else can we do? A churn. Do we need a churn? Yes, because we'll make because we'll need to make butter. Alright. So stick and a bunch of wood. Alright, so let's grab some oops. Grab some more wood. Let's make an axe real quick. That way it doesn't take forever in a day. Oh, I've been having zombie. Alright. There we go. Oh, cool. Diamond axe actually looks pretty badass. It's about all of its fanciness is being used to chop wood. Alright. There we go. And you... Well, you'll just be used as a reserve. Alright. Oh, are we out? No, we're just done. Alright, well you can just sit tight for a bit. Okie dokie. Let's see here. Alright, well, since we need more planks. Bam. Beautiful. Okay. A chain. Okay. Uh, let's do this. There we go. And... What way was it again? Okay. It's not all the way up. So it's right here. There we go. Boop. Let's just put that there for now. There we go. Actually. I can go... Where can I put it? Uh, over here, I guess. Yeah, right there is fine. There. Alright, so we got a churn. So now, uh, whatever ingredients it takes to make butter, we have the means for it. So there's our churn. Okay. Hmm. What other tool do we need? A corn. What do you need a corn for, I wonder? Do you actually need a corn this time? Who knows? It's there. Well, the option is there to make it, but I'm not going to make it right yet because I have no idea if we need it. When it doesn't take too fancy of a supply to make it, so I guess we'll just leave it. All right. What else do we need? Wax. Okay. Oh yeah, we're gonna make we're gonna make the uh, the, the trap. Did we make a trap? We did not. All right. So let's make the trap. Wait, I thought we did make the trap. We did not. I think I went to and I didn't. All right. So, boop. Nope. Okay. Um, just throw that on the floor for now. There we go. And there we go. I could have sworn I made this already. I feel like I did. But I don't see it. I probably put it somewhere and I don't remember. Go me. Alright. So, I think that's it. No. Oh. All right. Nope. It's this way. Okay. And this on top. This in the middle. String, string, string. Beautiful. And there we have it. Fish trap. Okay, so now we're going to make more sticks because we're going to need some bait. Well, easy fix. How easy? 
this easy. Because this whole entire village spawned in a block higher than the rest of the than the rest of the land. How that happened? No idea. So if that's the case, I'm gonna take advantage of it. There we go. There. Beautiful. Whatever. Alright. So, let's just... Okay. Let's just make our own and forget that a freaking furnace was right next to us, right over there. But it makes more sense to just do everything right here. So, <clears throat> uh, let's pull a me and real... Let's pull a me in real life and have it right next to the bed. Okay. Boop. Oh. Well, since we now have a source and some cobblestone, let's make some smooth stone and finish our pantry. Or somewhat finish our pantry. Yeah. The only thing we won't be able to make is this. Yeah. Pretty much it. Alright. So while that's cooking, let's... Nice. Nice. Nom nom nom. There we go. Noms. Okay. So now, what else? Now, I think that's it. I'm just waiting on stone to finish cooking. You done? Yes, you are. Beautiful. Okay. Um, yeah, I want to roam. Might as well make some tea as well. There we go. Okay. Now then. What were we making? Bakeware? Nope. We were making Morton Pedestal. Okay. Let's grab some sticks. Just grab one. There we go. One, two, three. What's that? Oh, stone ball. Okay. Morton Pedestal. Morton Pedestal. I don't I don't know how you freaking can say that. Juicer! Okay. Boop, boop. Boop, boop. And boop. Excellent. Alright. There. I'll accept the bakeware. Pantry is 99% complete. Nice. Um. I think that's pretty much it. Alright. So, we weren't very productive until the very end, but I'm going to cut it there. But uh, we got some quite a bit of stuff made. We got our pantry full. We made some beverages. Some nice hot beverages. There you go. So now I got a cup of green tea. And when the day's done, get to relax with it. Alright. So, I'm going to cut it there. Hope you all enjoyed. Leave a comment. And let me know what you think of the video. Uh, let me know... Um, if you want to just build everything legitly for Christmas, or if you just want me to just fly around creative, whichever, I have no problem doing either. Uh, if you're new here, go ahead and hit that uh, subscribe button if you like. Uh, and if you do like the video, uh, leave a like as well. It really help me out. So, with that being said, I am on Drum Shelf, and I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace.